Hey guys, I've been getting a few questions about my Phantom setup, so I thought I'd just post a quick video showing uh, my case and, and my Phantom itself and how I have everything working. This is a Tradecraft case. I really like the case. It's watertight, durable, it's foam, um, has wheels on it so you can drag it, a couple different handles. You can check them out online. What I really like about the case too is that this portion contacts just the top shell. There's nothing actually hitting the props, which I personally like. I don't like anything bending or pushing down on my props, especially if I've balanced them or, you know, whether it matters or not, I, I still don't like it. Um, my Phantom itself, running stock DJI props, stock motors, Phantom, uh, the DJI Zen, Zenmuse gimbal, Immersion RC 5.8 600 milliwatt transmitter. So I have a little piece of foam in here to keep the camera from beating itself up and moving all around in the case and a Shapeways lens cover. The antenna sticks out a little bit the way I have it mounted which is just velcroed, velcroed to the side here. You can see the wiring's real clean. I ha I'm running the DJI upgraded board which keeps things really clean. So to accommodate for this uh, antenna the props usually, spare props are meant to go here. I've just made a small cut in here to accommodate for that antenna, and then I, I use my neck, put my neck strap in there also. I've got seven DJI uh, brand Phantom flight batteries. Could fit eight, but I'm using the last spot to fit two of these Hyperion 12 volt batteries for my uh, FPV monitor and receiver. got my chargers here and I've actually got two of the uh, DJI Phantom chargers in here and then all my wiring to not only charge the flight batteries but to also charge um, the JST connection batteries that I'm using for my FPV gear. I think it was only meant to accommodate one battery, uh, I'm sorry, one charger originally However, I just took out the little piece of foam at the bottom and just sliced it in half and uh, fits two plus all the wiring needed just fine. Moving over here, I've got a little piece of foam that I just added on top so when the case is upside down or being transported, these little loose items don't fall out. Got my 5 inch FPV monitor from ReadyMade RC. My harness that connects my FPV receiver, monitor, battery everything on the transmitter. I've got two buoys which I'll be using soon for flying over water. I need to make up a mounting system for them. My Immersion RC Uno receiver which goes on the back of the transmitter. Some spare transmitter batteries and lastly uh, some tools. The prop wrench, two and a half millimeter Allen and a two millimeter Allen along with a uh, voltage checker for checking my flight batteries. In this compartment, I just uh, here's my transmitter, but also jammed kind of in this little portion in the cutout is uh, the mount for attaching the the monitor onto the the transmitter itself, which I'll be posting a video on and showing that how I'm doing that also. I've also got the DJI Phantom upgrade lever, and you can see the the Velcro for attaching my components on the back here also. So that's about it, guys. Um, if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to ask, and I'll do my best to help you out. Thanks for watching.